Hey, so, welcome to a video with me without any makeup on, and this is going to be a quick video because it is going to be the first video in a series that I call This Product Don't Fly By Me. Aren't you proud? That's such a better... I can't talk. It is a much better name that I came up with instead of check off the receipt. I don't know what I was going with that. Anyway, so the product that we will be reviewing today is this one. This is the Vichy Purifying Foaming Cream for Sensitive Skin. First note, you can't really buy this product in our Off the Vichy USA website. You can off of the French one, and you can off of Amazon. It is around, uh, let's see, it is around $24, $24.15 to be exact. I don't know, maybe they discontinued it because they kind of realized it wasn't the best product in the world, which I give Vichy kudos for, because why keep a product on the line when you know it's not gonna sell? Business genius right there. The French version is called Crème Moussante Purifiante du C pour Sensible, so that's the same thing but in French. And this is paraben free, which is great, so you know you're not putting nasty things on your face. Anyway, I wanna quickly read the back of it to let you know what it claims to do and how to use it. This rich and soft cream foam gently cleanses makeup and impurities without drying out the skin. The skin is left feeling soft, supple, and refreshed. Tested on sensitive skin under dermatological control. Dermatological, yeah. Massage onto damp face. Avoid contact with eyes. Rinse off with water. So, this product was given to me by my mother because she has a thousand cleansers and decided to be generous and donate one to me. So she gave me one that would break me out. But actually, let's roll back a little bit. I used this before I went to New York for eight months and it was fine. Maybe because my skin wasn't used to the nice kind of moisture in the air that is the humidity on the East Coast, but instead of the dryness in California. So this moisturizing component, this has shea butter in it. Uh, shea butter seed cake extract to be exact. It helps to moisturize your face and that's what makes your skin feel really, really soft after you use it. So I'm just gonna quickly show you what it looks like. It's kind of an interesting texture. It's a bit lumpier. It is definitely not a cream. And when you do, massage it also, it kind of separates into this funkiness, but it is very nice texturally. It's smooth, and then you just wash it off, and when you do, you're left with very, 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 very soft skin, buttery skin. I'm really sad to say that I can no longer use this product because it does tend to break me out. I am without makeup right now, and I'm in an Abercrombie hoodie. I don't shop at Abercrombie anymore, but this hoodie is six years old, and it is so comfortable, and it's like the only thing I have left in my house because everything is in New York. Anyway, that is that story. But yeah, my face looks decent. It's got some pigmentation on it. That is completely fine by me. I just need a little covering up to beautify this, and it's all good. But... <sighs> When you start to see little, little, little pimples come out towards like certain spots on your face where you know you've cleaned it all off, I think it's just time to say this product don't fly by me and that it's got to go bye bye. So definitely don't try this product. Actually, I won't say that. This just doesn't work for me. It I've heard, I've read, I've not heard, I've read many, many reviews online saying that this product is really good, but unfortunately the only way you can get this, unlike the way my mom got it, which is at a CVS because they hold the La Roque Posay and Vichy products and other ones, you're only going to be able to get this online, and I think that's a little bit of a bummer because sometimes in the store you can test it out or get samples, burp, but otherwise you can't and you're just gonna have to kind of go with your gut just you know jump out there and try it out but anyway this video is gonna be really short it's gonna be under five minutes so i will see you guys in the next video bye